I'm Big Carl, and this is uh, little Daryl here. His <laughs> kids have named him. <laughs> yeah. Oh, where the hell that came from? It was because you was little little Daryl initially, weren't you? Because you were sat behind me on the on the yeah, canoe I'm kayak thing. thing. Quietly. Okay, okay. Right, I've actually come for a purpose. Uh, this, I'll get it on video. Is what I keep my firebox in now. I know I take out my bush box that I bought, but that's for my light lightweight stuff. But in here, I've got my firebox, which is my lump. Use that down, you know, your proper Gen 2 firebox, stainless steel, and, then, and a few other bits in there as well I keep with it. Um, but I got this pouch from Ed. On. Yeah, I will. Don't worry. You're not going to stop me. Go from here to EC Woodland Craft. He didn't do any at the time. And I said, um, I've had some leather work from him before. I had this lovely thing, which is my tinder pouch. Um, and also my knife sheath he did for me. Uh, sure, there's something else as well. But... Yeah, so I asked him to do me a firebox pouch because I saw how good his level work was. And uh, he did me one. I couldn't tell you what the price of them were now because I think I paid, this was the, his first initial one that he did. Ed wasn't happy with it. I don't know why because I think it's, yeah, I mean, you can see his insignia on the front there. Ed wasn't overly happy with it. Ed's not overly happy with a lot of his stuff first time he get he's very much perfectionist but he's uh very good at what he does his leather work is spot on and um he'll knock you up anything you really want so if you fancy something a bit different um if you want like your own sheath or something i'm sure he'll be able to do that if you send your knife to him um i'm sure he won't mind me saying that yeah he's done people nice sheaths uh, and he does also a load of things on his Etsy, uh, on his Etsy shop. So if you go and check him out, I'll put his link to his uh, Etsy shop down there. And he's got all of his stuff on there. He's been pushing the firebox pouches now, I think, for Christmas. Because um, he's made a shed load of them to get out for Christmas. But yeah, go and check his stuff out. Honestly, it is top quality. Um, Daryl will say it is. It is, isn't it? Yeah. I've had a little look, but yeah, he's already uh, looking at getting one. It's decent, it is. But he ain't got. Have you got a firebox yet? No, but. <laughs> it's nice to buy one just so I can buy this. This is just. That's a good idea. Quality. Yeah. <laughs> that is. I like that. That's that is. Don't it's know why hardcore, happy, isn't it? Though, so That's why. Yeah, I know. If this is the one he's not happy with. That was the. That was the first one he. Ones he's happy with, yeah. That was the first one he pumped out, and he was like, yeah, I don't know, it's just a couple of bits of the stitching. I, I weren't overly happy. I was like, just, just where? That straight line stitching, I think it was the weld at the top here. He didn't like how they initially came out. I'll show you the welds, because they were what? He didn't, there you go. Awful, aren't they? No. Ed, seriously, such a perfectionist. But yeah, go check him out. Link in the description.